The village of Okba was surrounded with so many money trees. The rows of the trees were number one, never take money from the trees at night. Number two, never go to the city. Number three, don't marry more than one partner. These were the rules of the trees passed on to the children by their forefathers. They had an abundance of money trees but less crops. So every day, the villagers journeyed to neighboring villages to exchange the money for things they needed. This went on for so many years. The life they lived were just basically taking money from the trees, going to neighboring villages, exchanging the money for things like chicken, tomatoes, peppers, just basic things and they'll return back to their village with these things. And then after a while, they'll go back again. Days turned into weeks, weeks turned into months and the youth in the village started going against the rules. The young men in the village wanted more women. So they started going to neighboring villages, offering money to young women and marrying these women. They started having more wives and that was against the rule of the trees. The young women from Okpa village started going to other neighboring villages and they started buying off humans and using them as slaves. These people they brought to the village also started disrespecting the trees by stealing. They also partied round the tree at night which was against the rule. After a while, the money trees started producing less notes and one morning, they all woke up and the money trees had disappeared. That was the end of the money trees in Okpa village. Up to this day, there are still rumors that the villagers are still trying to grow money trees in Okpa village. Do you think that is possible in 2024? Let me know what you think in the comment section. They are still trying.